Alright. Yeah. Oh, how about we use this shot for this next scene? Have it cut quickly. Right around there. That's a good spot. Okay. How long do you think this will be? Couple days more? Oh man. I know it's a long film. One of our longest projects together, but damn. Yes, it doesn't help that we have a lot of footage to go through. That reminds me, day three, scene five. We have a lot of takes for that. Um, the producers have um, told me what they wanted, so I am going to have to go through all of them. In order to pick the best ones. Yes, I'd like you to watch them with me. It's... Well, I could watch them on my own and write notes and then relay them to you. Or, we can watch them all together. And then pause whenever one of us has an idea. That and you know we can just give you a timestamp, so that you can just skip to that, right? That would be faster, more efficient for both of us. I know, I know, I know. We'll, we'll talk about this later, but it is getting late. I don't want to overwork you. <sighs> it is troublesome. You know... But I am excited. I mean... This movie has been in the making for what, years now? We've been working with everyone for so long. I know, I know, there were a lot of setbacks. Weather is a bitch. That earthquake didn't help. But we finally got done with filming, we have got the score, we just need to finalize these last few scenes, and then we can start showing it to people. And I'm, and well, I, I don't know about you, but I'm excited. At the start, I didn't really know this series, and through research, I was, I was forced to confront the source material and I have been ecstatic about it ever since. And I know you have been too. I mean, it wasn't that long ago that we had that con and we met up on accident in cosplay. I just want you to know that I appreciate your hard work for this, and I'm sure the writer will too. I honestly, I just talked to them a few days ago and they were excited. I showed them a bit of the opening scenes and they, well, they had some things to say, but you know generally good 
things. Yeah, their, their complaint was that the quality was kind of shit, but I didn't send them the best quality. My internet was kind of dying, and uh, the agency really wanted me to send it to them. By then, I had no other choice. It's not your fault, I promise. And I know that, like, once this comes out, A lot of people should be getting more praise from the public, from the audience that we're working so hard for. But you know what's gonna happen, right? It's gonna be the it's gonna be the actors in the spotlight. If people really don't like it, they're gonna rag on the writers or me. Probably me. But whether it's good or not in the end, no one really gives editors and stunt people and choreographers the credit that they deserve on big features like this. So I just want to let you know that I really appreciate you and I thank you for all of your hard work. I mean... Can kind of understand why though when you see something when you see a movie you don't you don't really notice if it's well edited or well mixed you notice if it's done horribly though because it's a job that's not meant to take the attention of the viewer and I I just want you to know that even though it is a job like that, I appreciate that you're doing it for us. Okay? This isn't the first time we've worked together, and I hope this isn't the last. You're one of the best editors I know. You know what, though? I have kept you for quite some time, and I am hungry. Are you? I'll treat you to dinner. Oh, yes, I have seen the latest volume of it. Yes, yes, I know they're... I know they're planning on turning that into a TV show, and it's not really my forte, but... I do want to see if I can be the director for that, and you already know that you're my first pick. After all, we've worked together and you're also a fan of the franchise. How do you think it'll end, though? Ah, wait, no, don't answer that. Let's talk about that over dinner, okay? My treat. <laughs>